Yes, uh, unfortunately, we lost some men of the armed forces, both uh, the Air Force and the Army. And again, uh, we went to commiserate with the Nigerian Air Force about the losses and uh, the armed forces in general. And I uh, also thank them for the collaboration. They've been very supportive and uh, they've helped us seriously, so they should not relent in their uh, us. And uh, we have come to the villa now, my senator, the member House of Representatives, uh, to also thank Mr. President uh, for his own uh, for his uh, support, and uh, we need uh, a lot of collaboration with both uh, uh, the local communities, the presidency, and even the state. Uh, we are looking at two options. First, it's non kinetic. As a government, we have uh, uh, put in machineries to start talking to the bandits, the other elements that are not uh, in tandem with uh, uh, living uh, peacefully. So, as a government, uh, we've created a Ministry of uh, Nomadic and uh, Pastoral Affairs to look at the uh, issues of the Fulani headsmen. You need to understand that Niger State is the, has the largest congregation in the world of Fulani headsmen. Niger State is uh, uh, 8.3 million hectares of land with bodies of water. Uh, uh, the pastoral uh, environment is very good for grazing. Uh, a lot of Fulani across the world, not just Africa, you know, converge in Niger State. So we don't want them to leave. So we don't want any major military activities. We want to talk to them. But if uh, uh, if uh, we don't get uh, to that uh, uh, level, then probably we have to go fully military. Thank you.